Morning guys, bright and early and welcome to a day in my life as a medical student on gastroenterology. If it's your first time here, welcome. I'm Harry, fourth year medical student. As you can see, I'm wearing these nice comfortable blue scrubs at the moment. Here you go for a nicer shot. Usually as a medical student, we're supposed to be dressed in professional attire. So dress shoes, collar shirts, etc, etc. But on gastroenterology, Typically we have procedures running, procedures happening early in the morning. So for my own convenience, I tend to just come in, you know, rock up in scrubs nowadays. But yeah, right now I'm walking from the hospital car park to the wards for the morning ward round. Let's roll. Alright, so I'm currently at the residence office on the gastroenterology ward. It's around 7.30 now, no one's arrived yet, and we're about to start rounding very soon. And this is where all the registrars or residents and house officers or interns do most of the work during the day. As a subspecialty medical team, we round our own inpatients along with consults from other specialties. For example, if a patient on cardiology suddenly has a stomach bleed, the heart doctors can't deal with that, so they call us for a gastroenterology consult. Around 70% of our inpatients came in with either liver diseases or because of acute bleeding from the stomach or intestines. We also take elective admissions for endoscopies, where we can look at the patient from the inside through a camera, something like this. Alright, so we've just finished board rounds, it's around 10.30 right now and I've decided to jump over to the endoscopy unit next door and watch some procedures. Okay, so I've just had lunch. It's around 12.45 in the afternoon right now. And one of the consultants or attending is running a clinic this afternoon. So I've decided to just jump along and hopefully I'll learn something from it. But before that, I need to get changed.
So, I've just got home. It's around six o'clock and it's also getting dark outside. I've just gotten changed and for the next two hours, I'm gonna be working on a case history for a patient that I've seen today. So a case history is basically, if you think about the doctor's notes when they see you in clinic, but because we're medical students, we're supposed to produce a sort of like a formal report that's including more details of the patient's history and examination findings. So yeah, I'm gonna get onto that and then it's dinner time. So the patient I saw today is a 38 year old Asian male who was brought into the hospital a few days ago with hematemesis, meaning vomiting fresh blood. This is along with other symptoms such as stomach ache, dizziness and being short of breath. He admits that he's recently been taking lots of painkillers for some lower back pain. Common painkillers such as aspirin and ibuprofen actually increases the risk of stomach bleeding. The patient subsequently underwent a procedure in the endoscopy suite, having a camera put into his stomach to see whether there was any bleeding down there. If you've enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like and subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in the next vlog. Bye!